Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is it right here, guys. The biggest update the Fire TV Stick has ever done, and it's on all your devices. Whether you have the old 2018 4K Stick, the Cube, or the new 4K Max, the update applies to all of those. So what is this update? It's basically the ability to populate all your live TV apps into one location, guys, even those third-party apps. It's pretty cool, guys. You're gonna wanna stay tuned for this one. Let's go. All right, so what did they do? Well, they added about a year ago a tab on the Fire TV Stick home screen called Live. Now that allowed you to have those live channels for Prime and a couple other apps. And then it would compile them to where you could access the live TV. But a lot of it was playback, not much of it was actually live. Now it's live and now it's all the apps in the Amazon App Store and including those third-party developer apps. So there are a ton of channels, I mean thousands and thousands of them, that you can add completely free to your Amazon Fire Stick. Basically eliminating the need for cable, guys. It's pretty cool. Let me show you on the TV right now. All right, so I'm on the home screen and the first thing you're gonna to wanna to make sure is that you have the latest update, guys. So to verify that, all you have to do is hold the home button down for a few seconds on your remote and this is a shortcut button that will take you right into settings right here. Now you're gonna go down to My Fire TV. Once you click My Fire TV, click About and then you're going to look down here for Check for Updates at the bottom. If it says Check for Updates, go ahead and do it. If you have the latest update, great. If you don't, update it, guys, because as soon as you do that, you're going to see this. Let's go home. All right, so on your home screen, it's gonna say live right here. Go down to guide. Let me show this to you guys. This is really cool. So what it's basically doing is taking all of the third-party apps that you've downloaded and it has compiled it into a full live TV guide. As you can see, all the channels right here. Now, if you look at the top of the screen, you'll notice the first one is live sports. You go to live sports, it's gonna organize all of your sports. Breaking news, it's gonna be all your news channels, guys. This is live TV. Prime video channels, if you have Prime, if you have Prime, it's a great way because you're getting hundreds of channels completely free and they're all located right here. Pluto TV, a bunch of channels, Plex, and these are just some of the third party ones that I added just to show you how it works, guys. Haystack, all of these. Zumo Play, Tubi, tons of them. And if you wanna add more, you can click on channels right here and you can actually look at the other apps that you have downloaded. So these are the ones right here that I have currently, my live TV sources, but you can add so many many more to this, which is pretty cool. So how do you find different apps that you can do this? Well, it's gonna be in your app store. Basically, you go to find, go down to app store. What I like to do with my app store and kind of the way I've always done it is I always go to the uh, all categories section and then I will select movies and TV because that's where they're all gonna be for this right here. And then I specifically look for ones that are live TV apps. And as soon as I add all these in, and again, these are free ones, you could put your subscription ones in here as well um, if you have paid subscriptions and then it'll populate those with those as well. But as you can see, there's tons to choose from and you can add a bunch of these and you can throw them on the guide and just have thousands and thousands of channels. And I just wanted to share this with you guys because before it was only available on, in the US and in certain markets and only with the newest Fire TV sticks with Fire OS 8. Guys, now they've done it so you could do it anything 2018 and newer. So that's going to be those 4K sticks, the cubes, and the uh, 4K Max. So those you're going to be able to update it and get this. And they're also launching it in other countries. So I've already heard that they have it in the UK. They're starting to do it in Canada, Australia, other countries as well. So no matter where you are in the world, if you don't have this now, you're going to soon. It's really cool, especially when you start adding all these apps. Now, if you have an external drive, it's even better because now you can put more apps, literally thousands and thousands of channels, guys. And I watch all my sports on here. I travel with it. And it's cool because it compiles it all together. Everything can be done on the home screen now. It used to be that the Fire TV stick just had a bunch of apps and you had to open this app for that show and this app for that live TV and this app for that movie. Now it's all in one location, guys, which is really cool. This is by far the biggest update Amazon has ever done. So if you don't have a Fire TV stick, I recommend getting the 4K Max just because it has more storage built in and it's faster process. So it just works a lot better. Um, and if you have one already, update it. Check that out, I think you're gonna love it. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you're new to my channel, please do subscribe. I do videos, tips, tricks, all this kind of stuff on this channel. And comment down below, let me know what you think of this video, and let me know which app you think is the best on the Fire TV Stick, and I might do a review on it. Thanks again, everybody, bye. I really hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, do us a favor, just hit that thumbs up right down below this video. Share this video with those that you think would like this as well, and don't forget to subscribe. We have tons of videos on this channel just like this, so make sure you check those out as well. Thanks again, everybody. Bye.